Alright, this is for all you speed run junkies. So, stock system comes with another, uh, comes with a center diff. And for speed, you don't need that. You don't want that. So what I did was I went ahead and put in a spool right there. And uh, then you can, you know, put any spur gear on there you want. So this is the Revo uh, application. I got a 36 tooth spur on there. And on the motor, I got a 21 tooth. I did have to Dremel out the motor mounts in order for them to mate up. Uh, I'm not going crazy right now because if I go any higher on the motor mount, I know I'm definitely going to have uh, shut off issues with the ESC. But is it fast? Faster than it was? Hell yeah. This thing is a beast right now. I do have some fast eddy bearings in it. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but... Yeah, that little spool is pretty cool. It'll accept any any uh, spur gear, pretty much, with the stock diff, center diff. You were very limited. You couldn't change out your spur. Um, there was a few, like... HPI Durango option options like 46 tooth I think and but I heard diff fluid would leak, leak out of the um, diff case and we don't want that so I just changed out the whole diff put in the spool and uh, run an Eternity Graphene Lipo 65C gets a little hot so you don't want to do back to back runs um I definitely got to open this thing up somewhere though. But man, it is fast. Really fast. Got these belted tires on. Alright. Uh, what I notice is I don't have as much torque. And that's going to happen. Which is a good thing for right now. Because 21 tooth and 50 tooth spur. I was still coming up in a wheelie. And uh, one time I slid down a street probably 150 feet. Burn a hole right through the roof of the body. So. That's not really happening. I can ease in through the throttle. And uh, man this sucker zooms by. But yeah it's a beast. Everything's running good with that spool. They definitely need to come out with some more motor options though. Motor mount options. Uh, definitely Traxxas is better with that. So. I think I might just get another center spool. Just to have on the side totally rebuilt. And um, whenever I want to go bash, I could stick that in and then, you know, put in like an 18 tooth pinion. Because speed runs are only fun for so long. You know what I mean? Got to get out there and bash too. So, other than that, man, the car's holding up awesome. It's a beast. I do have some footage. From my Mavic 2 zoom I'm going to throw up with this thing on, uh, it's still on 52 spur. I haven't got any footage with this on the uh, 36 tooth spur. So if you look down here, man, you can't even see the spur gear coming out. It's like way up there. It's funny. Alright guys, well, just a little overview. A couple little mods I did. Had to do a little... Dremel metal work. I find doing the mods is almost as fun as, you know, driving. So, Alright, I'm out. Peace.